Now I'm charged. Alright, where the hell is the planet? Ah, oh, there it is. Hmm. Looks kind of odd. Screen. It was me! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't really. I'm not out in space trying to oh, perfect my Batman impersonation. Yeah, I think it's just rendering things. Yeah. Sector 17822. Is that the planet? It looks like uh, a station. There's a station to the right. Mm -hmm. Is it the derelict station? I think it is. Oh, but uh, we can't actually salvage anything from the relict station. No, but when we get rich, we can buy it. Can we? Oh, uh, yeah, exactly. <laughs> How rich? Very rich. Yeah, it's a derelict. I think it's one of the uh, spaceship ones, isn't it? No, perhaps not. No, it's the basic one. Hmm. Although, tell me that it doesn't look like some kind of giant death space laser pointed at the planet. <laughs> it looks like this uh, uh, woodpecker thingy uh, that dips into glass. You lost me. You totally lost me. A little exercise in thermodynamics. <laughs> I think they had uh, one of those in uh, Nostromo's... Uh, mess hall, didn't they? I wouldn't know about it otherwise, but uh, somebody tracked down uh, the... Uh, well, compared the uh, movie and game and uh, and the woodpecker thingy was, uh, was I think, featured in game. <coughs> it's basically just like a stick with a little bird head on it and a tail. And the bird head dips into water and then it heats up and gets out of the water and so on. It's just a wee sort of desk fidget thing, a bobber thing. No, oh, fair enough. You know, like a Newton's cradle. Yeah. It just sits there going back and forth. Hmm. <laughs> well, yet another this rip. planet bottom. looks uh, sufficiently evil. <laughs> evil. That's uh, that's the weakness, though, isn't it? We don't want a planet that looks evil because ah. then people will suspect us. Good point. We want to we want to we want a planet inhabited solely by fluffy animals, so it looks like a peaceful, happy place. When people arrive, we shower them with gifts, you know, like those those flower necklaces that you get when you turn up on Hawaii, made from lead. <laughs> Gifts instead of lead. Everyone gets a lead enema. The food was nice, but the welcome party was a bit shit. <laughs> okay, while you're navigating it, I need to bring a glass of water. I might go get a milk. The desert planet with cactuses. We are near some sort of uh, cluster, aren't we? If I, if I look at the map. Or is this... Oh, it's the planet that shows up uh, as, a, as a cluster of dots. Mm -hmm. And the grey dot is the space station, isn't it? I can see a purple asteroid. I don't know which way I'm facing uh, compared to you. Yeah. In, in We're not near any stations, by the way. Hmm? We're not near a station, we switch planets. Hmm. In the minimap, uh, on my left, <laughs> which is very helpful, uh, is a grey dot. No, it is, yes, we're turning towards it. Yeah. You know we're facing the same action because oh, okay. you're slave to my ship, basically. Okay.
Well, I don't see the asteroid. I don't see anything in that direction. Some something is there, like uh, yeah. I see the dot. Yeah, yeah but I don't yeah, yeah. see anything in space. What is it? Oh no, there is an arrow pointing to something. But on the le uh, we ah, mm. it's like yeah. Now we move past it, I think. Because mm -hmm. the distance increased again, and if you face downwards, downwards and left. Uh, mm, okay. No. Uh, was oh. I don't see anything here. Huh. Anywhere. Weird. <laughs> Why is Nux out of his ship? <laughs> I could just like crash him into the planet. <laughs> Enjoying the view. Oh. Mm -hmm. Oh. Desert planet. Yes. With missing chunks, apparently. Hmm. Whoops. And cactuses. Those uh, poles are cactuses. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I think this is brilliant. I think I have been here. Like, that ravine looks kind of familiar. Hello. Hello! Well, there's only so many types of planets. Yeah. You may have been a desert planet. Yeah. What platform is that? Is that an actual structure or is that the... Uh, uh, ah, no, those are rendering issues. The, yeah. yeah, it's just the uh, side of the other faces. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Would be cool mm -hmm. if there were actual plateaus like this. Mm -hmm. oh, excuse me. So, what do we want? Small grassy planet, big desert planet, big ice planet. Um, I think we should go for a big planet. Yeah, the larger. Probably the better, maybe. Um, d was the was the ice planet near any asteroids or meteors or anything like meteors? Astro, just ast Let's just stick with asteroids. Is it near any asteroids? I think there was probably. some some near this one. I saw a purple one from from the visuals, didn't there? I think it was, I think it was here. Well, let's assume that they all have asteroids or don't or whatever. All equal. Mm -hmm. Which which one will we prefer? Mm, let's, uh, go, let's go for desert. Go for where? Desert. Desert. Here. Here. Yeah. So I was kind of leading towards the ice planet because oh. it's got a big flat surface for landing big ships oh. on. Oh, okay. That's just my opinion. Like, you know. I I like the ice planet as well, but I also like that massive cavern on that 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 other planet that we went to, the one Laura suggested. I really like that sort of like docking area sort of thing. Um. So I don't know. I'm sort of torn between Ice Planet and and, and Laura's Planet. Well, the Ice Planet has big uh, chasms in it too. The mm. uh, the little planet can be like a sneaky uh, secondary base. An outpost. Yeah. Somewhere where yeah. we take all our supplies back to and then forward them to the main base. Yeah, especially since it's uh, it's like uh, in such a central location, or maybe I don't know. <laughs> We are no good at making decisions. <laughs> Excellent work. Put three indecisive like, people in a I room like together. Desert, I like desert planets, but uh, Gigi is uh, is uh, guiding the ship, and uh, the practical aspect, like landing, is kind of important. Yeah. When we get the super carrier, we're not going to need to worry about that so much. Though. Look, it's quite even. Hmm. It's also quite small. Oh, oh how dare you! <laughs> well, my vote is for the ice planet, Lord's is for the desert planet, and Nux is for the ice or the green one. 
So I think the over sort of ruling, <laughs> the, the one with the most things in the most boxes is probably the ice planet. And then we'll yeah. use the other one as the outpost. Because once we get a supercarrier online, that thing's non non uh, atmospheric, isn't it? Or any supercarrier is non atmospheric. So we wouldn't land the thing. We just take our landing parties well, out. Could. On the ice planet, we could, yeah. Well, if if we cl if we glance the face off of it perfectly. Well, the ice planet is perfectly flat on the surface. Is it? Is it now? Hmm. You have piqued my interest, good sir. Brain. No, let's let's not do that now. Quite <laughs> convenient. We have a desert planet right in front of us that we could maroon you. <laughs> maroon me with the ego ship. You sort of just like fly toward the sun and just detach you. <laughs> That reminds me of that. Thing. It's totally irrelevant, but it reminds me of the. Um, oh shit! Uh, it reminds me of uh, you remember in Red Dwarf where they got Kachansky on board, and they go up against the Gelf, and they're like, "Well, if we think there's a bomb on board, like they'll think there's a bomb on board, and it's just all confusion, shit, and everything." And then they flew back and like, "Where's the bomb?" Ah. <laughs> I probably didn't yeah. explain that very well, but you get. What I know I mean. the one you're talking about. I yeah. Think. Um, they were chasing the Gelf ship, and then they turned and ran. They confused the Gelf. Mm. Into Hang on, why is he running? Yeah. He's a bomb on our ship, and then they turned around to chase him. Mm. <laughs> well played, Kachansky. I, I preferred uh, original Kachansky, yeah, though. I haven't watched past season one still, so I, I don't know. Season one was probably one of the better ones, to be honest with you. Original Kachansky is the nuts. Like, she is just cool. And she's from Liverpool as well, isn't she? Was she Liverpool or Scottish or something? Oh, I don't know. I think she might have been Scottish, actually. Yeah, everything's moved around. Well, that's because we're not in the right system yet. We were very far away. <laughs> Where's the captain's office? Over there, where it says captain's office. Where it always says captain's office. Where it always said captain's office. I think she was Scottish, wouldn't she? Original Kachansky. Ah, oh, if only we'd known. <laughs> she was cool. I liked her. Better, much better than the new Kachansky, who just seems to be some sort of like glamour model for the for the crew. To be honest with you. And you read about it, and all the fan scripts. Like whenever sort of like Ace Rimmer comes back. And he's, he says to Lister, oh, who's that? And who's the beautiful woman? He's like, oh, that's Kachansky. And Rimmer's always like, did you take a bump on the head or something? That's not Kachansky. <laughs> so, oh, parallel universe. I'll have to explain it all later. <laughs> okay, I think that one was the ice plan. It's chart to drive up. That it's not leaking. As much as I hate to say it, they have to end Red Dwarf soon, right? They ha that either has to be a happy ending, or a sort of cliffhanger ending that we can all write for ourselves, you know? Or not? No, because the cliffhanger ending pissed a lot of people off at the end of every dog has his day, and today is my day. <laughs> that was funny. The ending itself. Not so much. Mm -hmm. Remember, only the good die young. <laughs> that line was pretty good, though. Yeah, that was pretty good. Oh, when Rimmer's, Rimmer's like earlier on in the episode. Oh no, it was uh, it was Lister, wasn't it? Early on, like if death comes for me, I'm gonna. Oh no, what was it? He says he says something like, "Oh, if death comes for me, I'm gonna go out the way I came in, kicking and screaming." <laughs> 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 I need to use the bathroom. I don't know why I just. Uh oh. Uh -oh. <gasps> Server doesn't answer. Oh no. Me. It's good that that message fades once you reconnect. I'm a big fan of that.
warning. Pardon me. <laughs> that was quite mm. loud. Sorry. Apparently milkshake makes me burp. Yeah. Are we at the planet yet? Mm. I think it's doing some serious loading according to the server log. Are we there yet? I, I, I'm staring out at the, the red space. DR, you need to pull into space services soon, man. I gotta oh, take the leak. I'm getting a whole lot of stuff in the console about uh, loading chunks for planet. So. Mm. But I'm not there yet. <laughs> Although the server not responding message is gone. Maybe we just didn't make it. Everyone's dead, Dave. <laughs> yeah. It had to be said. Three million years? Still a library book? Are you smoking in the drive room, Lister? Yeah, I gave up for quite a while, but I'm back on them now. <laughs> I can't write it down, I'll have to remember it. Where are you, stupid planet? <laughs> How the fuck do you miss this planet? Ah, target sighted. Oh, I can Sorry, I'll stop doing that now. I was just, <laughs> just doing the orchestral version of the Red Dwarf theme to him there. It felt like the copyright police will get you. <laughs> yeah. It's like the, um, it was the perfect music for flying through space towards a planet, I feel. <laughs> Just my opinion. That might be why they chose it to advertise a sci-fi program. Might be onto something. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Yeah, this planet has those uh, glowy crystal things. Ah. I've seen uh, like a few ships on YouTube that use those for like thrusters and like, glowy accents and stuff. So do you like my parking? <laughs> It, li it literally is just a flat face. Yeah. <laughs> That's amazing. Sorry, Planet, we weren't being rude there. Uh, you being flat faced is actually quite a compliment. <laughs> Apparently, my ship is just sort of teetering over the edge. Maybe I should uh, move over a little bit. Is the Kion display? Does everybody know it's us? That's the important question here, DR. Yes. Excellent. <laughs> the Chaos Squad are in town, and also apparently the Dyslexic Squad, because K doesn't stand for Chaos. Mm, I do like this. The only issue is it doesn't seem to load very well. Surely, once it's loaded once, uh, it will it will still pick up in in the future. That was going to be one of my concerns. Well, we've loaded it now, so surely it will just stay loaded in. Concern alleviated. And yes, but it's taking a very, very long time. To... Anything is it got glowy stuff? I like the glowy stuff. I like the glowy, glowy. I like the glowy. I watched that yesterday. Madagascar. Ah, okay. I was gonna say it's a it's a song. Yes, but it's associated with the movie. Yeah, it's uh, popularized thanks to Madagascar. Or repopularized. It was quite. It was already a pretty good song. Mm. 
Mm. Chewits did it as well, didn't they? Chewits, they had an advert. I like to chew it, chew it. Remember with the fucking dinosaur? I think he played Connect 4 against uh, Godzilla, didn't he? Oh no, or was that a monkey? It might have been King Kong versus Godzilla in a Connect 4 match. Oh shit. Oh. <laughs> I fell off to space. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, now you're in the ship's gravity. Mm, I wonder. Can I? Ended. Ooh, um, you want your ship back? <laughs> Me? It's okay, I'll just drop it off. <laughs> Please don't. <laughs> <laughs> this is quite nice cavern here. Well, how are you going to get into the ship otherwise? Uh, you can't jump up to it. I don't know. Let me try something. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Apparently, it just didn't get caught in gravity. <laughs> Whoops. Oh well, see ya. <laughs> Bye. Can I run off the surface? Oh, <laughs> orbiting. I want to check out this cavern. What's this? Agave? Um, they might have went into the ship's core or the planet's core. Sorry. Ice coral. Ooh. And what are these? Funeral trap. Hmm. It's a tarp. Yeah, that did not go well. <laughs> no. Okay. Oh shit! I'm. It looks as if I'm for. I'm. I'm. I'm swimming in lava, but actually, I don't think I am. I'm not. I'm not swimming. I'm drowning. Help! <laughs> Reality's broken, mm. but I think I came through the other side and I'm actually on my way towards junk. Du, 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 du. I fell through the planet, apparently. Yoink. will fall into planet 2 and we are doomed. Mm -hmm. Doomed. Doomed, they tell you, doomed. Doomed. That's out of dad's army. The uh, Undertaker guy. We're all doomed. <laughs> Scottish. <laughs> ah. You fell into the planet. Your ship was gone. Where are you? I'm in the planet, <laughs> apparently. No, you're right of it now. This, this reality is weird. <laughs> I suggest you dock up. Dock up like Doc Ock. Yeah, you heard. <laughs> I shall be doing so shortly. Uh, um, where did you go? I... There is a pool party at Maine. <laughs> I'm on my way. That oh, man, you can stay and enjoy the pool party. I don't mind. All about the pool party. Ooh, that's an interesting look inside. Or is it just not loaded right? Or is it just like one grip big color? It is. <laughs> it's like a planet face sized cavern. Yeah. And gravity. <laughs> uh oh. Damn you, gravity! Oh, I mean. Reverse. Reverse. Nuns. <laughs> Fuck! Fuck! Nuns! Reverse! Uh, Laura probably has no idea what you're on about. I have no idea what I'm on about 90% of the time. <laughs> well, that makes two of us. 
Oh. Whoa. <laughs> Of course, be scary. <laughs> Frame rate two. One. <laughs> yep. Yeah. You know the computer's in trouble when you have a ping of 700 to local host. <laughs> Fuck, you know. Oh, we're back in space. Yay. Mm. All night I've been trying to use this lighter, and to be fair, it's quite a tough lighter. Like, the flint doesn't go around properly. Mm. Just remembered, right? My thumb is in tatters. It really hurts at the minute, right? It's uh, poor thumb. Ooh, boo hoo. But um, I've just remembered magically, being a human being, I've got another fucking hand with its own thumb. Isn't that amazing? And it also works to light the lighter. Ah, oh, miracle. It's you are so smart. Mm. SMRT. Mm. I mean SMRT. SMART. <laughs> you should get. You should get a cookie. <laughs> no, I don't for, deserve for a your cookie. Human ingenuity. Aren't they nuts? Snipe playing star made. Yeah, he totally is. Oh well. Who who knew? <laughs> Not Steam apparently. Hmm. I charged the drive, activated, and nothing happened. Mm -hmm. Except the capacitor draining. Which is. <laughs> mm, I'm kind of leaning towards the. Uh, what do you call it one night? Desert. Yeah? Yeah. I'm um, game, mate, for whatever. Whatever's easiest for you to load. Yeah, I would prefer the ice planet, but it's just too you know, much. If, yeah, if it's not going to load properly, we'll just end up fighting it continually. Yeah. Which why, is a shame. Why is it? Why is this uh, ice specific problem out there? Like the way the blocks look, or hmm? or is it I don't know. Big? I guess it's just so darn big. That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> so if we could find at some point, if we could scout down a smaller uh, ice planet. Yeah, I don't know. Similar resources, I think, maybe. Yeah. Well, we can still go and visit that planet, or just mm. eat it, maybe. <laughs> Although I don't know if the server would like. Struggling with such a planet and struggling with like a million different lasers. The lasers! You can get out of your ship and actually go down and harvest stuff mm -hmm. manually. You actually get more ores by harvesting manually. Yes. Because you sort of have a brain that, you know, you can get extra stuff occasionally. Yeah, when I was uh, in that uh, little green planet, then uh, occasionally I would get the message that that I was lucky and I got two ores from one hole. Mm -hmm. Planet! Come planet! Uh, I don't think that's the right planet, it was the desert one. But I didn't, didn't know the coordinates, I just knew it was in the same system as this mm. one. Can't see how it looks yet. I'm pretty sure that's the desert planet. Or not the desert one. Maybe it is. No, that's a little green one. Oh, okay. Oh yeah, the coordinates are those of the little green one. Yeah, that was it. I wonder can I dock in here?
<laughs> I hope our planet that we choose is near a shop. Hmm? I hope the planet we choose is near a shop, because we're going to need one. Mm. <laughs> just, just, just look at the um, like the size of the face of the planet compared to the ship. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so tiny. Hello. This planet's good though, eh? We could probably make something out of this. It could be a little secondary base, I suppose. Yeah. Outpost! I just, I just don't think it's quite big enough for parking our ships on. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that's, that's why I... that's what I meant, that the, if we could make uh, an actual space station incorporating the planet. <laughs> Yoink! Imagine we build the space station onto the planet. Yep, that was my idea, pretty much. <laughs> well, with this planet, it's more like build the space station around the planet. Yeah. We'll have our own death egg. Pardon me. <laughs> Well, for my next trick, I might consider blowing my nose. Ah. You're supposed to blow the bloody doors off. <laughs> yeah, see, this planet loads much quicker. Mm -hmm. Like, it's already half loaded and we're already there yet. Instead of waiting 10 minutes for the other one to, like, load 10%. And it doesn't look too evil, just abandoned. And there's probably some nice caverns and things in it. Spice! Hmm. Holy shit, what's the yellow stuff? Oh, this it's... is some kind of structure. Yes! Oh, hello! The underside of the uh, <gasps> planet. Whoa, those We, clothes. we are going for an exploration. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> this there, is our new headquarters. There is a freaking structure down there. There's a chest in the middle of it. Yeah, look, okay, okay, this is the scheme. We're gonna use, we're gonna, we're gonna roll for initiative, but we're gonna use Laura's plus 12 in archaeology skill, and we're gonna discover what's going on down there. Plus 12? Give me some plus credit. The, the limit's 16, come on. And 16 is like master archaeologist. <laughs> yeah, I can and, see inside, you know. And there's like, what are those uh, pillar thingies? Well, that, that's what we're going to go like, explore for. Like it looks like um, parkours with a light on top. The central block, however, looks like a chest. You know, an item containing... Maybe it's treasure! <laughs> I never thought of that. <coughs> oh, in, in Wasteland 2, when you find a box, then, uh, then the default message is, Maybe it's treasure! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, somebody's out of their ship already. <laughs> Greedy bastards. You can't stop me! <laughs> Let's no, but kill I probably it outrun place. you. Because <laughs> I got a secret weapon. Oh shit, I forgot about the gravity. Yeah, you guys are going to need to come pick me up eventually. Oh, there's like starfish on the floor and stuff. That's gross. Can we, okay. can we jump out? Oh, Max is already out, isn't he? Yeah, I'm, I'm on the run, mate. Do not disturb the surface. <laughs> Do you want me to yep. get my paintbrushes out? Yeah. We start excavating properly in it. Right, what's at the top here? Is this our evil base? Is this our <gasps> evil lair? I'm not saying it's aliens. What is it? You haven't got the hair. I'm sorry, Law, but you haven't got the crazy hair. Aliens. I haven't even seen that thing. I'm, oh, I have fair only, enough. I have only. Uh, damn it! Okay. Lord, we need, we, gonna, why the hell am I trying to go down to the planet? I I'm can just use flight mode. I'm going build mode now. And we, in build mode. We need to create I shall, an entry. I shall enter this land. It is a container. <gasps> it is a container. I don't know what's in it. I'm in build mode. But it is definitely a container of some description. And Nux is digging his way mm -hmm. in. You can't stop me! <laughs> it's alright, I'll put the bricks back once I'm done. Oh my god, let me out. <laughs> I can't stop you. 
You probably can, but please don't, because we're about to discover something amazing. Oh, I need a giant like pyramid shaped ship that can land on top of that. <laughs> no, and now I'm back in the ship. Fuck. No, 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 no. Damn it! And now I'm upside down. <sighs> yeah. At least you're not inside out. Open block inventory. What's in here? Holy crap! There's actually some okay. stuff. Nox charge crystal wedge. In Ice, line, orange, orange standard armor, post, uh, post if module. I, if, I, if I was the pyramid's uh, caretaker, I would put a booby trap in there, so like, watch out. <laughs> well, it's a good thing you're not, because I'm still alive! <laughs> no, I mean, uh, I mean, if I had built this pyramid, I would have uh, put a booby trap in it. Ergo, I suspect somebody else has put a booby trap in it. <laughs> Yeah, there's stuff in this chest, like what? lots of cool stuff. I saw a floating chest. Was that to you? Yeah. Hello. Floating chest. Hello. Mm-hmm. <laughs> hey, what? There, the there was in? an opening underneath it. Wait, let me put some lava down. Whoa, what's the green foliage? Okay. Six. I think Five. this would make a completely appropriate evil base. <laughs> we even get our own sort of living areas and stuff. And DR can park the ship up there. What block did it give me? What are you? Yellow standard armor. Okay, the entire building is made out of armor. <gasps> it's an armored pyramid. So Hello. the pyramid... Yeah, I... Are you telling me the pyramid itself? It's more valuable than uh, than the planet, yes. Than, yeah, or or any loot inside any chest. Yeah, but we should probably <laughs> turn it into an evil base before we go <laughs> ripping it up. Surely, you see that? Um, if you look up the yard, the roof's just square there. If we topped the pyramid, you'd have a landing bay. <laughs> but how are we going to remove all those blocks? <laughs> <laughs> Just, just give a little elephant mm -hmm. top. <laughs> just his head. Yeah. <laughs> Job done. Lord, do you want to come check out this chest? I don't know if you're still recording, but you've got to wait, show the loot on wait, camera if you are. Wait, yes. Uh, got a lot of loot. Yeah, there's a lot. Where, where of are you? Out or in? Inside. We're at the chest in the middle. Just a second. I'm, I'm under the pyramid, making my way up. Are you in build mode? No. Oh, okay. When I went to build mode, uh, I was dropped back to the ship. Oh, you're well away from us. Have you found another pyramid? <laughs> Pretty much lucky. The amount of resources, resources. What did I just pick up? Yellow standard armor. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Um, the bedrock you is You know that the floor armor. where you are is 50 blocks thick. Really? She's 50 meters away from me. <laughs> <laughs> Bloody hell, and the whole floor all the way down to be armor. Mm, no, I I can see the inside of the pyramid now. I have broken through the floor. Oh. And I think, uh, I'm pretty sure most of it is just dirt. Yeah, there you go. Hello. Hello. How's it going? <laughs> what the hell is that down there then? What is this? Is that a ship core? Yeah. Okay. Are you trying to take control of the pyramid? Why am I upside down? <laughs> Look at you! <laughs> Hi. <coughs> You're like the companion cube. Let me cube. put in additional lighting. You're like a low-res Wheatley. <laughs> <laughs> Duh, hello! <laughs> Space! <laughs> now I can enter build mode. And zip oh. around, have a look. So what's in here? Whoa! Yeah, no, that's wait, exactly that's, that's, our thought. That's my overdrive effect computer. Purple holly pen. <laughs> I like how was like, that's mine. I'm taking all of that then. No, I mean, uh, mm. no, no, no. That's that's my inventory. Ah, okay. On top of this, so the. Aha, uh -huh, okay. Now I get it. Filter active. That's a lot Charged of cash. Man. Crystal wedge eyes. Orange standard armored corner, green advanced armor. 
<laughs> DR, I've just corner. figured out how we can get that roof Black off. Black Corner. <laughs> uh, did she? Weren't you running out of... Uh... Oh, you were running out of armor pieces, not... Uh... Uh, yeah, uh, better black pieces. armor. Yeah, it doesn't matter, that's a blue up. Center circuit wedgie. Center. <laughs> Centered wedgie. That sounds Center painful. Hmm. No, wedge. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> so what? Should we call it this land? We should definitely call it this land. Sounds good to me. We need a faction module. Um. Do we have to buy them from a shop? Yeah, I could just pinch the one off my ship, though. Someone's got to do a shop run, the Nicky Nan. What? What's up with this core? The core is destroyed. What happened there? I packed it up again. Oh, okay. Just, just lag, I guess. This is, this is my my little stairway from underneath. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I saw you breaking through. I was like, ooh, what's going on over here? Well, you see, you don't want to leave any evidence. Mm. You know what? Uh, I'm thinking, let's not pilfer this place, but let's leave a message. <laughs> we're oh, no, we're, we're going to take it for our home. Yeah, this is a pre-built base, pretty much. Pretty pre-built evil base. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but uh, is it is it built by another player or is it? Uh, yeah, it was built by the other guy on the server. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like, the we're server's only DR, on it? Have access to. <laughs> Yeah. Oh okay. <laughs> no, I, I didn't realize whether whether there were other others in the server or, or what. Dr. Um, I seem to have hit a flaw. In my haste to to find out what was in the mirror pit, I appear to have forgotten how to get back up to the ship. Oh, don't worry, that won't be a problem. Mm -hmm. Your two ships are still docked with mine. I know. And I'm going home. <laughs> <laughs> Come back here! I don't think I've got. I've even got a ship core. Could you imagine that getting stranded out here and just go, like, uh oh? Yeah, always carry a ship core with you. Which I totally am. Oh no, you're both gonna leave me here, Dr. Can you jump into the Millennium Falcon and uh, guide it to the planet's surface, please? Well, I can do some of that. Uh. I don't, don't, don't know about the guiding part. <laughs> Throw it into the planet. I'm not going to steal your ship core, I'm not that mean. Yeah. I, I kind of am. <laughs> <laughs> I was actually just going to put a few ship cores in the uh, chest. Oh, cool. Yeah, that works too. I think um, I have a few extra as well. I have, I have four ship cores. Who's buying all the ship cores? Well, just for the good measure. <laughs> oh. Oops, I dropped them. down here. I accidentally dropped two ships on my toe. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds painful. Plex undetonator. What in the hell? What? That's a uh, spawn point, isn't it? So you click on that and it makes yeah, these. Where did they come from? Pfft, no clue. You are asking the wrong person. The only stuff I've got me on me is this. Oh, I've just. Okay, something is seriously broken here. <gasps> hole in I the am... ground. No, 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 no. I don't. I don't want to go to a hole. If you put stuff in the box, it doesn't become the stuff you put in the box. It's aliens. <laughs> Dio, you, your head is moving so slowly. You know when Stewie in Family Guy. <laughs> you know when he turns his head like. <laughs> oh, like, <laughs> what's going on in this fucking box? It's a magic box. It's witchcraft. Mm. What's in the box? What's well, in the box? It's up to you. You put whatever you like in there and it converts it into magical items. Oh, there's 666 cannon computers. That's not good, is it? That's a bit like, ooh. Oh, I think I have circled back underneath the pyramid because <gasps> I have is it? the armor again. Pyramid power, Digi. It's not a glitch. The game's not broken. It's pyramid power. <laughs> 100%. Right, now that that's mystery solved, how the fuck are we going to sort this uh, computer problem out? Unless you just drop like two ship cores, I get in one, you get in the other. But we do it outside so that, you know, we don't have to fly out of a pyramid. Or I could just do that. What have you done? 
Oh. You can't see it from there. So, are we going to claim this? Yeah, I think we are. Planet? Yes. It, it, and we should call it this land. I think if we should call it your grave. If it has a on it, then yes, we, we claim it. <laughs> yes. We will take advantage of the ancient alien technology and claim this world. Okay, I'm actually going to bury the faction module a bit. I am making... Take system control for actually yeah, make that home. I'm making a little system is not ours. Little... What would you like to call the planet? <laughs> this land. This land. <laughs> 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 we don't fuck about when it comes to naming our whole worlds. It's done. Excellent. Can I fly this ship core inside my ship and and make some sort of like shipception? Oh, Jesus, I can. So stuff's only going to start breaking from here on out, really, isn't it? Let's be honest. You can dock ships inside of ships. <laughs> I shall explore this land a little bit. Oh, okay, now I have dug out my dug myself out from the thingy. Wait, did you put a faction beacon down? Yes. So that planet's now ours? Yes, so and the solar system. Whee! So we can start building within it. Yes, you can place a build block down if you wish. Okay, cool. Okay, I well, have let me some just... uh, factory modules as well. Should I place them somewhere? You can do whatever you want. So, ship go, come back here. Do you have prefer preferences about them? Because I don't know how they really work. Well, if you want to experiment with shit, I would recommend just sort of picking a little corner or something and you mm -hmm. know, keeping it all together. Mm -hmm. Other than that. But like, should it be inside the pyramid or? Well, Actually, probably. No. Otherwise, you won't find it again. <laughs> uh, I have marked an entrance with lava. <laughs> you have been marked. <laughs> oh, we can use these plaques on detonators to set our spawns here. Actually, I am going to try and place the modules uh, capsule refinery. Basic factory. Blue light, new power capacity, disintegrated docking module, build block, rock, shield capacitor, shield recharger, shield core, white light. Just so you know, if you're in this system, you now get bonuses for mining. Mm. That's pretty handy. Oh, it's cool. I'm docking. Hmm. <gasps> Did I? No, it was Nux on docking. I just got oh. the message for some reason. Oh. Me too. Mm. Okay, I'm gonna try and put down the thingy. Open block inventory. Uh huh. Okay. Ah, okay. So I, I shall put uh, shit in, and then. Uh, And yeah, you set the recipe gonna... and then mm -hmm. put okay. the stuff in for it. Okay. I think there's a button for like a graph or something that tells you the, the recipe. Well, for now, I'm just gonna place them in this little area over here next to the thingy. Mm. Well, I want to go mining. <laughs> and your ship is still attached to my ship. So what do we do about that? No, seriously, what are we doing? <laughs> Will I just drop it off here? Like, drop it on your face. <laughs> no dropping spaceships on people's faces. You had a court order about that, honestly, did you? <laughs> what if it hits them in the back of the head? Is that all right? <laughs> I've lost the side that the pyramid's on. So, <laughs> I have microassembler. Oh, there we go. Capsule refinery. Basic factory. <clears throat> no, I don't I don't want to Oh, I was able to enter build mode with this wait what? Oh, oh, okay. 
That's handy. Along the way. So, uh, I have I have a build block. I'm, I'm gonna pick it up and take it inside the pyramid so that we can build ship uh, shit there. It works. Uh, looks like it works uh, as the ship core. Yeah, it lets you enter build mode. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know what I'm gonna do with it. Dun, 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 dun. Your ship's up here, by the way. I shall give it a gentle nudge towards the, oh, the uh, yeah, surface. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's coming down. Incoming! Yay! Falling junk! Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> 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 okay, please drop on the correct side. Yes! Awesome. Like a glove. <laughs> yes. Now that we have landed on this land I'm I'm gonna make a break between recording because uh, last time I made like three hour long episode and uh, I couldn't <laughs> upload it in a day 